Oh god, what am I doing to this guy? <laughs> oh, it looks like a very creepy person, don't they? Fiddler. If someone said the word Peter, that would be literally what this character looks like. It just doesn't look right, in my opinion. Bitch! Somebody tells me I shouldn't have done that because you might have been quite helpful. Alright, so one thing I should say. Welcome to the um, hard car uh, permadeath, whatever I'm going to call it. Um, should I use these? 1 to 19 is a very weird number. It feels like 5 to 10 is better. Is that just me? Oh well, let's put it on. Uh, and the Doom Knight helmet, it doesn't do anything. But it makes me look cool. I know what, if I put that on, I can't be Fiddler anymore. Uh, I won't be able to show myself as Fiddler. Yeah, I'll take it off. And Kaboom. It feels like we're going to be in for a very bumpy ride. Alright, so it feels like first we should do something a little more simple. And I'll try and be smart this pull it through. I'm going to try and be smart. I know it's not very easy for me. Okay, the only 4 damage. Oh, 17, there you go. Okay, uh, I should probably use this from now on. To like, get some avoidance. Didn't work. And didn't work. Okay, thank you avoidance. You were helpful. Very helpful. Alright, it feels like I shouldn't be using this. I mean, it just feels too random. And I don't know if I'm happy with it. I'll, I'll take it off for now. Avoidance. So the main reason we're actually using the um, rug is because of the cryptic class. Um, but on the Discord, looking for people's advice, which you can join if you want, link in the description. <laughs> um, but yeah, found, found the cryptic. Apparently it's the best um, a Tealan class. Or however you say that word, I always mess it up. But yeah, apparently the best class. It's funny how like easily I'm getting killed by like three Sneevels. But look at that XP. That was just from one fight. Do any of you guys know exactly how, um, what do you call it, hard mode works? Because I tried doing some research yesterday to, um, find, like, maybe a multiplier, how it multiplies the damage, or health, or XP. But, I don't know, I couldn't find anything. Do you actually get more XP from, um, hard mode? Because I don't know. I might go kill some more things first. Oh, no, man. Healing pad. I'm kind of scared of this fight. Oh, right. Okay, there's nothing to be scared of, apparently. Um, I haven't used the uh, rogue in a while. Oh, yeah, okay, yeah. Oh, no. So we're going to try and grab the crow tick as fast as we can. I had a feeling there was like a level cap, like a level requirement, but I can't remember. And I tried looking up and I couldn't find anything, so yeah. Alright, we'll go do the honey quest because it's quite easy. And I could do with something quite easy. I need to get some gold. I'm not leaving this place until I have a decent fire or energy based weapon. I want to go kill the, um, what do you call it, the Hydra. With as much power as I can. Because on hard mode it could be quite difficult. I mean I don't know but. Maybe. Hitler level 5. Nice. And we also get our defense. Which is really nice. Because defense is. Why am I doing that? I already have a shield. Oh well. Yeah, these defenses are gonna save our lives. 
These are, like, the cryptic is, like, a really good class, but I have 120 mana. Uh, and abilities on the cryptic cost, like, 20, 25. So it's like, I might not be able to really use it yet. Until I'm, like, a bit of a better level. If you know what I mean. Just a thought. Royal Buzzer is no match for the Fiddler. Fiddler will destroy you. And Fiddler is not afraid. Fiddle, fiddler, fiddler, fiddler also can't talk properly. I was gonna make him bold, but apparently he can't be bold in this game. I don't know why. Like, there was no hair option for bold. Why not? Oh god. Damn, boy. Why not? It doesn't really make sense. Why can, why can I not be bold? Oh well. Honey. Okay, so we got a dusty old term, which means I think I can get this shellac. Uh, yeah. Awesome, we've got a pet. It's not a very good pet, but... One pet is better than no pet. Obviously. We are now in the land of copyrighted music. Every time I hear this song, and I record it, my videos get claimed. Which is perfectly fine, but I'm just saying, it's a bit annoying. Because apparently the music is not... ...royalty free. I never heard the music before, so I don't understand... ...why, I thought it was just... Arctic Entertainment's own music, but I guess maybe not. Okay, so one thing that is kind of worrying me is that I don't have a good weapon. Uh, it's a little bit alarming. I mean, we do have like an unlimited healing pad right at the doorway, which is really nice. But I need a new weapon. I haven't got one yet. I, mean, I could buy one, but I'm saving. I think I need like 200 gold for like a decent dagger. Maybe? Can't remember. Okay, I think I'm gonna go buy a new dagger. I was literally in that fight for about two minutes. Wait, do I lose my XP if I leave? No. I can't remember. And I can't remember ever leaving a quest. Oh, uh, it's 150 gold for a decent dagger. Should I get a shit one for now though? I can afford this one. Which is a lot better than what I've got, but... It's not the best, is it? I mean, I could wait until... Yeah, let's go get... 20 more gold. Alright, well, the Ninja Dojo seems like a much easier quest. For some reason, these guys only have 22 health. I mean, those stupid Sneevels in the tree fight had like 40. So, um, we're definitely in for a bit more of a easier fight. I just want to get 20 gold to buy a sword, a dagger. And maybe more if I can. Okay, well, I'm going to be here a while. I just got one. <laughs> We did get a nice stun though, which is nice. The one thing that always kind of annoyed me with the rug is that the stun doesn't do any damage. It does damage over time, but no damage itself. And it always kind of irritated me a little. I don't know why. Maybe it's just me. Why is it so expensive as well? Compared to everything else. I mean, one thing I should have done was leveled my character's stats. But there's no reason I forgot. I don't normally forget that. I normally do it as soon as I level up, but... I guess when you're an extremely low level, it can be forgetful. Because you're leveling up constantly. I have never been in the need of a new weapon ever in my life as much as this. Normally when you go through these quests, you can get one quite easily. Just from one of the quests, but I'm not finding anything. Bear in mind I've only done like two quests, but still. Still. Normally in those two quests I find something of value. It's taking me so long to kill anything. <laughs> A Steevil with 22 health and it's taking me like two minutes per fight. <laughs> it's kind of embarrassing, but still. I guess 22 health is quite a lot when you're a low level. Oh no. I thought there was like, supposed to be a... A healing pad in here. 
I guess there's the next room. I've got no mana. Oh wait, have I killed myself? Um. Okay, so it feels like I've done a bad decision. Wait. I'm gonna kill these, I level up. Don't die. I better not die in this turn. I probably won't. Because they're not very strong. And I've kept this fight and I've got half my health bar. I just can't do anything except attack. Which is kind of bad. Either way though. I mean this guy is dead. There you go. Okay. We get a level up. That'll save our lives. We also get a poison now. 20% weapon damage or 5 turns. I don't know how good that is. Especially at this level and with this weapon. Okay, it's pretty bad. I had a feeling. I mean, I was lucky to even get one damage there, to be honest. Because 20% of 3 is about 0.3. So I was lucky to even get one, to be honest. So I can't really complain. There we go. Oh no, he's being guarded. Being guarded by someone. Die. Even though I did no damage. I don't know why I said die. It's kind of funny how hitting someone with your dagger can do zero damage. Bit weird that. I mean it is bleeding him over time but still. Oh, amazing sustenance. <laughs> nice. I wonder if... The, wait, is he a boss battle in this um, quest? Isn't it just like a, a big ninja? He might be like a challenge. I mean, probably not. I am playing hard mode and these guys are still doing like 4 damage but I think um, doesn't hard mode do like 50% more defense and health on the uh, health health and damage on the enemies so I guess if it's doing 9 it would technically be doing like 6 so I guess r right at this point in the game it's not really going to make much difference until I'm a bit of a higher level, I guess. Okay, so we have got a big one. Um, I will do this. And then Sherlock, you can punch me in the face. Or fly at his face. And I will stealth and get my epic surprise attacks. And there's nothing you can do about Shogun Snizix. Get wrecked. Oh, 26. Damn. That was like the best hit I've ever done in my life. Not really, but that was a pretty big attack. <laughs> Wait a sec. I just had a thought. Thought the sword I could I got from the other quest I did. I could have kept it and sold it. I normally do that, but I forgot. I'll keep this one there and sell it. God damn it, I'm stupid. I could have had a dagger earlier. I mean, I could definitely get one of them right now, but I might get a lot of gold from this sword. Uh, daggers. Sell split second. Oh, okay. Thank you, one gold. I mean, why is it worth one gold? I can't be the only one who's confused about that. Okay, so should I get the light dagger or should I wait until I get this one? I mean, this one is like twice as good, almost. Um, I don't know what it says when I get. Not the carrot. Um, okay, we'll buy this, and we can observe up for the Hydra's curse. I mean, this pack is lightning, so I guess it's good for um, the Hydra anyway. Oh, it does look pretty nice. Um. Well, not really. I thought it looked better down there. Anyway, um, I guess oh, I can level up and heal on potions. I can get my stats. I mean, um, train. Oh yeah, it's free. So I've got an amulet, I think. Okay, so we get um, ten, ten, and ten. I think that's like a bit of a reasonable thing to have right now. 
Yeah, look at that man, they're in health. Damn. It's nice. A nice amount extra. Okay, we're back in the tree fort, and I'm not afraid- Oh my god, why have you got so much help? I don't like this quest anymore. Why is this quest so scary? I, I understand they're Sneevels, but they're very scary. Ow. And they got a hair a little bit as well. Oh well, I should be able to do it. There's no reason I can't. Ow. Why did that hurt so much? That did 25 damage. That is like 10% of my health. Why are you so much stronger than him? Oh, this guy's weak as shit for some reason. Okay. I'm not complaining anymore. Oh wait, that, that comes to realise how tough the other enemies could be. I mean, this is a normal Sneevel and he did 25. I might as well start stunning everything, because I have got the healing pad. But it's like, I might just want to fight the Arkers or the... Do I fight a boss in this? I think I do. I might just want to strong they're going to be. Alright, we've done the easy part, and now we're on the harder part. Right, you're a Sneevel and you're a normal Sneevel. Okay, sounds good. Um, you can attack this one. I'll let uh, Sherlock fight this guy. Even though he'll be about there for an hour trying to kill him. But you know. I'm nice like that. I, I'll let give my pets a chance. To prove themselves. See look, 4 damage. That was like one of his strongest attacks. I mean he can do 5 in total. Well, I'm gonna let you finish this guy off actually. I would hit this guy, I don't want to waste my damage on that. Nice. See, Sherlock is good. Sherlock is not bad. He's probably the worst pet in the game, but he's not bad. What's this? Oh. <laughs> I was hoping he had got like a 6 damage crit. That would have made him like the most overpowered pet in the game. Not really, but I'd like to think so. I honestly think hard mode must definitely be giving me more XP. Because I've never been level almost 8 at this point. Normally in Urkla I'm struggling to level up so I can do, go do like uh, Anna's quest. I, I normally do like everything in Urkla before I leave. This is what I like to do. And normally like you have to be level 10 to do say Anna's quest. And normally, like, I'm struggling to get to level 10. And I have to go do some farming. But now I'm, like, literally almost level 8. Oh, no, it's an Aka. I'm literally almost level 8. And I've done, like, three quests. Kind of weird, that. So I guess maybe you do get more XP. Unless when they change the XP increases, they kind of mess something up. And it's like a glitch and now like, even lower level players get more XP. I don't know how it works, maybe they did. Or maybe, hard mode gives me more. I think it's supposed to give you more gold. <clears throat> I'm dying. But I've already got like, nothing. And at this level you get such a little amount of gold. It like barely even makes a difference. Uh, sword chuck, apparently. This fight is literally taking me ages. Because I keep missing my attacks, and I don't know why. There you go. I missed like two attacks in a row. And it was very annoying. As you can probably tell. And days again. One thing that is good about the um, rogue stun is that it lasts 4 turns. Normally the last 3. Oh no, it's 3. No mind. <laughs> I thought it was 4. Oh well. I mean the damage of the time is quite nice. I... Bang. Dead. Oh, there you go. Level 8 already. I have a good feeling about this run. I mean, it's not... It's going to be harder. 
definitely. But yeah. Oh wait, you're a boxer. Uh, never mind. He's not much stronger than his actual friends, so that than the normal Sneevels, for some reason. You thought a boxer would do more damage. Nah, he's actually weaker. <laughs> well, it seems that way. Knock, knock, knock. Right, this is like the third stage of difficulty now. Kind of. I can't remember that if we had a boss though. I think we did. Right, it's time for big boss man. Um, Devil Box Lord. Okay, you have a lot of health. 29 to 33. Okay, this might be a bit of a challenge. Uh, let's um, stun him. There's nothing wrong with a good old stun. And then we can, when that runs out, we'll um, shield and stealth and stuff. Sounds good. Might as well. Okay. The first real fight of this game so far is a Sneevel. <laughs> kind of funny that. We're not fighting anything like really powerful like oh Drakath is going to be quite a challenge isn't he? Oh Drakath and his little big fiery red black golem thing is going to be quite a challenge I think. Oh well. Right, how, how much damage are you going to do? Okay, quite a bit, but I've got this. Definitely got it. Let's do this first. Right, we'll, stop, we'll use our shield now. You never know what's going to happen. It's best thing to use a shield. He is pretty tough there. There you go. Now it's easy mode. You can't hit me. Well, he can, but not very easily. Oh, uh, that's four turns, not the stun. Okay, the shield is four turns. I thought the stun was four turns. That's okay. Four turn shield is nice. And surprise attack. Nice. And I think we have a throw. Oh, we also have this. Nice, and then my throw should finish him off, maybe. No, it won't. Never mind. It won't finish him, but it will almost. There you go. Okay, first challenge. Done. <laughs> there you go. Nice. Okay, we found a random golden poniard. But, um, it's kind of shit. I wonder if it's worth a lot because if I sell it, I might be able to get, um, 55. Oh, if I sell that, I can almost buy that, um, yeah, let's do it. All right, we'll sell. It's good to have a weapon of a different, of a different element, but if it's worth that much, we can sell it and then we'll have, like, we need 8 gold until we can get this one. Awesome. 